We know if they go back to back, back to back, back to back on a particular issue. And they will say that we talk about that. They will say the government something we don't hear. They will seal up their ear. When they seal up their ear, they will go back to sleep. Friday, the 24th day in the month of February 2023. If to send our primary school we day, we will start with this is the day that the Lord has made. We we rejoice and be glad in it. This is the day that the Lord, the Lord has made. We now know why? Because me and my brother Unkubi don't start countdown since as it takes concern the 2023 presidential and national assembly elections. As the matter like this now. Now one day remain. Tomorrow, Nigerians in their numbers go come out to vote for their preferred candidates. When go drag the motto of this country as president, or those who go they make laws for the Senate and the House of Representatives. Very important action when every Nigerian citizen, when they reach the age to vote, and when they don't collect their voters' card, must do. We're not going to talk too much today because, on top of the show today, now education, 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 has to take concern the importance of participating in that process. My name now is Ezugo Chukwode, and this now as in the heart. I am making for no loss. My name is My name remains Unkubi. Welcome to As in the Heart. Our Ugonga visitor, when they join us on top of As in the Heart special, now journalist of so many years of experience, now joy, say me and Unkubi, they sit down here with them. And I did very sure, say those when they house, when they always they watch As in the Heart special on Fridays, Una, they learn a lot. Uncle JD, welcome to As in the Heart. Thank you. Thank you. Thank welcome, Uncle JD. But there's, a, there's, today is not the day that the Lord has made, it is tomorrow. Tomorrow, eh? Uh, it yeah. is tomorrow. Because it we don't go there yet tomorrow now. Say, on yeah, top of us, you could have sung a song that said, Tomorrow is. It not go, it not go rhyme. It not go rhyme. It not go rhyme. That's yeah, how you have the Tomorrow. And, and it is important that our people, we will not tire of telling you the significance of voting tomorrow. Mm. The significance. If you don't have a PVC, support those who have a PVC by encouraging them to go and vote. Mm. Okay? Thank you very much, Uncle JD. You could say you start with that particular one. Say, uh, if you not get, support those when they say... Support them. If you can give them... I mean, if you have children, for example, young ones, you can't go there. Go and give them, make sure they are comfortable. Carry something along for your fellow voter mm. that you can share. Mm. You know, let's show a bit of love tomorrow. And let's show the world that, you know, that we are matured people and we have a lot of care and love for our country and our people. Very, so very go along. Good. If you buy biscuit, buy two. If your fellow, um, whatever. Very true. Uh, yes. Uh, Uncle Jedi, good as you start with this one. This one really shows say the direction we go go today. On top of Acid Hot Special, that direction we go lead us uh, to the right destination. Make we begin first with the numbers. It is important. Make we start with the numbers. By the numbers, we mean the number of people when we say go participate for that election tomorrow. According to information when we say INEC give us, INEC talk say. 87,209,007 PVCs, that is permanent voters card, now if they don't collect across the 36 states of Nigeria and the federal capital territory. And the person will give this information at the INEC chairman, Professor Mahmoud Yakub. Uh, the INEC chairman talks, say, uh, giving the number, hey, now waiting there on a screen like that. If you now check, now the map of Nigeria, then all those green, 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 green circle. Now the different states when they inside of Bodo, Nigeria. If you check the numbers when they inside, uh, now the numbers of PVC where they don't collect for the different states. If you go near your TV now, you go if you check the state where you did now. Not be your state of origin, you know, the state where you did now, because the state where you did now, where you for register, now there you go vote. The total number now it is seven million two hundred and nine thousand and seven. Now, the different states distribution of the PVC is now there. Then I can also talk of the uncollected. Uncollected now say people will register, but they don't collect the permanent voters card. That one has 6,259,229. 6,259,229. Six million are plenty number. Why these people not collect? For some people now say they not see their own. For some, they don't relocate, come up for inside of Nigeria. We go also factor those where we say maybe don't buy before their PVC ready, but now the number be that. And if you can't check the summary of how they don't collect the voters' uh, 
card for the different states. Now, maybe the one when they the third slide like this. If you go near your TV, you go see them. But what is the most important now? Say, as Nigeria did like this today, 87 million. 209,007 people. Now, in PBC, they their hand. And would they expect, say, then go participate for the election tomorrow? Uncle Jenny, make I start with this question. Mm. They get one uh, language when then they talk. Anytime we election reach, then they talk, say, voter turnout. That will mean the number of people when come out to participate. Make I use the example of 2019. For 2019, I then carry their register, come out. They tell us, say, 84 million plus people. Now, in the register. By the time when the vote finish, they can't count all the votes. President Mohamed Wali will win in second term, win with 15 million plus votes. Alaji Atiko Baka win carry second, get 11 million plus votes. Then all the other presidential candidates together, if you join all their votes together like concussion, you know reach 1 million. 15 plus 11 plus 1, you know even reach 28 million. Now if you minus that 28 million from 84 million, you go see say, well over 50 million Nigerians no even participate. Uncle Jedi, maybe we talk about voter apathy. What if we that thing when they cause them? When we say some people go decide, say they don't want to participate and they don't want to vote. Uh, but okay, we have a thing say you go <coughs> give that figures and use them to speculate sharp sharp. Yeah, no, no, we first check first before we this, speculate. This 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 election will have a larger voter turnout. There's nobody that can convince me about that one. Mm. I know they follow debate who go win. Mm. Uh, because nobody can tell you, even the greatest. CS cannot tell you who will win this election, we won't do. Mm. Even those where they do polls. And the reason is very clear. Nigerians don't have a culture of telling the truth. Even Kobe, mm. ask me, say, who you go vote for? I feel like Kobe say, well, I say this one, I'll be there. So I thought, oh, I must be there. Oh, yes. Then you say, this one, I'll be man. Ah, I must be Tinubu, and so on and so forth. So nobody can tell you who will who, who win tomorrow. Mm. Nobody. Nobody. Mm. Uh, you know, but the turnout is going to be very, very high. And that is because of, because of the times that we have seen. Mm. Nigerians have suffered. Mm. We, 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 have, we have suffered. We have, we have had our lives, our currency, our life devalued. So many people now in their 40s and 50s are just dropping dead all over the place. The quality of life has almost gone down to zero. Mm. So... And we can go on and on and on and on, but this is not a time to start indicting. We need to look at what we are going to do tomorrow. Maybe we day focus. Very true. So, so people have done the right thing. They will be taking their anger and whatever and their prayer to the ballot box, mm. hoping that it will count. Very true. Uncle Jerry Novex, eh? Hoping that, that it, it will, will count. count. Uncle Jerry Novex, they don't they count us down to enter inside break. When we go this break, come back. Some of those factors where we say you don't highlight. Uh, we go like make you still shed more light on them so that we go know, say, okay, now this kind of thing is now in the determine how people go take come out and how people go participate. No go anywhere they come back. Now still accident special. You have to take the government some people down here. They will seal up their ear. Once they seal up their ear, they will go back to sleep. Here, they will seal up their ear. Once they seal up their ear, they will go back to sleep. Welcome back to Acid Hot Special. Ezuku Chukudi, Unkubi, and our Obonge when they join us every Friday on Kujini Disu, the inside studio. We don't start with the first discussion, the one we consign the numbers when INEC don't give us. And we tell them now, say, officially, INEC don't come out. Come tell us, say, uh, as it is like this now, the number of people where we say PVC, permanent voters card, they their hand now, 87 million, 209,007. The ones where we say they don't collect. So if we they go by, say, everybody where they collect PVC go vote tomorrow, now this number, nine people go, they expect. Uh, but Uncle Jerry don't tell us, say, if you check, oh, it gets some factors where they make people look, say, anyhow, where this thing be, I must participate for this election. So, and now why plenty will they come out to participate? Now, Uncle Jerry, before I allow my brother, Uncle be carry the second one, they go. I want to ask you another question. President Mamadou Buhari for the nationwide broadcast, when he do last week, he been come out to talk, say, he encouraged Nigerians to come out and vote for their preferred candidates. And he they assure them, say, security go day. And you know, say, sometimes when they talk about security for election, when they talk, say, ah, the way when we say security, they cajad where where. The thing if they put fear for people's mind. 
In fact, we don't see some videos from this week where we say our security people them, then they move strategic equipment. They go different parts of Nigeria. You think, say, this one go boost the confidence of Nigerians? Say, yes, uh, security guaranteed. We we'll go come out and we we'll go vote. Anybody who no one vote, if you say he no one vote, mm -hmm. because your voting booth, in most of the cases, should be a walking distance yes. from your home. Yes. You know, if you live for a last mm. you can not say you won't go vote for Lekki. Mm. That's not the way it works. Mm -hmm. Not be so. So anybody who no one vote, he no one vote, uh, be that. Mm. So that's a, a different, a different scenario. People should know that you cannot, you cannot submit your life to another person to live for you. Mm. This is the only time when you will, you, will, you will be in a position to say that these are not the people where we want, these are not the people we don't want. Though, having said that, you now have to submit yourself to majority rule. Mm. That is what is done in any country. We will say they head, they correct. You will have to submit yourself to the fact that majority, and that is as, as simple as that. But to sit back and say you do not want to vote, and then I don't like this thing where people go, they talk, say, oh, eh, maybe I, I don't want to waste my vote. There mm. is nothing called wasting your vote. Mm. Your vote is a covenant between yourself, your God, and your country. Mm. If the vote is a covenant between yourself, your God and your country to contribute to the leadership of your country so that you too can enjoy the benefits of people who live in good countries. It's, it's as simple as that. I believe that it is highly irresponsible for any adult who has the choice to sit back and allow other people decide for them. Mm. Because if you do that, you cannot come and complain. In fact, I hope it gets to a point where we say, even on phone-in programs, we will ask you for your voter's card before you now allow you to come and contribute. comment and contribute. Mm. Unless, of course, if you are, like in our own job now, a lot of us not go fit vote, medical and so on. We know that one. We are contributing our own quota. But to sit back at home, begin the read paper, they wait for a result, and then the following morning you become critical. Even God not go answer that card. Remember what I said. It, 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 voting is a spiritual thing. Mm. It's, it's a covenant to put your, this is part of your body, to put your body on this and say, I, 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 this is the man I want to rule our, our country. If you did not take part in it, then by simple common sense and by normal convention, you have no right to complain in future. Mm. Very true. But I want to plead with people to know that in a democracy, all of you can have your say, but the majority will have their way. Mm. Mm. So let us all be prepared, you know, for the results. As long as we have enough evidence or we do not have enough evidence to see that some extraneous issues have happened. Once it is an election and it doesn't go the way you thought it would go, well, you have to submit yourself to, to what the majority want. Mm. You now have to come and come and admit to yourself that this is the kind of country I'm living in and this is the way my people think. There's nothing you can do about that. Very okay, um, Uncle Jay, we went time to the next one. Now, this one got to do with um, the collab with the military and uh, the police, don't they collab? And um, according to what the report talk, the talk say the military, are, that is a uh, military and police don't vow to ensure they defend them um, and democracy. And I'm um, looking at um, the, the matter, uh, of course, the special will be they speak on behalf of them, the military them. That is Brigadier General Tsuko Guzal. He talks, say, look, um, they are honored to make sure they defend democracy. Oh, and um, say, ahead of this election, they will they strategize for different places. They make anybody, we talk, say, in stubborn, make you not just come say, you won't do pass himself during this election. It, because, of course, don't issue this warning to Nigerians ahead of this election. So, looking at this right now, will, uh, shall we go talk, say, this thing, they put some level of confidence in Nigerians who they can vote, or perhaps otherwise, because otherwise, on the ground that, okay, Nigerians put up, say, our oh, military don't feel every uh, they go to different places. That same anxiety, that same panic, feel no day for Nigeria might to say, oh, because of the military, make, make something not go happen there. Uh, because of that, make cannot go do this. Do you think it is going to further encourage Nigerians to turn out, or perhaps, in a way, discourage some? Nigerians are not serious people sometimes. 
And I say it without an apology. Majority of us are not serious. And why do I say so? We got independence on a platter of gold. Maybe if Nigeria had gone through what South Africa went through mm. during apartheid, maybe our head go down correct. Mm. Do, do you understand? We, we, we keep giving excuses because we have this habit. And when I'm saying this, I don't mean everybody. Mm. I mean majority. We have this habit of wanting other people. We have a sense of entitlement. You want to sit back. You want other people to, to, to go. If some of us will not get him. Some of the boys out there who are going to conduct that election are sponsor very young people from National Youth Service Corps. Mm. Why then go say they're not going to go? Mm. Go there. The place is very close to your house. Mm -hmm. And what, what I had the Captain Blade on my program yesterday, he said, the military way they see, do not assume that, oh, because you don't see military, we are at the pole and whatever, mm. that therefore you can do nonsense. No. They say they have what to call, was it not the blanket that they come meaning that they are nearby? Mm -hmm. Today for radio, sheriff, they say, I beg, make a help and advise people. Those who don't buy guns, one don't do this, don't do that. Make a help and advise them, say, make they're not doing because of major presence. I said, I'm not the advice anybody. If you know, say, you'll be man, try it. Mm. With this current level of security, this is, I'm not the beg anybody. If you say you stop on. Mm. If you think, say, you're stubborn. Um, like I just say, let me advise your parents. Mm. Mm. Because you cannot find elderly people doing this. Mm -hmm. Let me advise your parents. Parents, hold your picking well. Very true. Hold your picking well. All those ways, you, you see, they drag you, bow, they do all this. You see, they shag, they, they go out to bed. Try it. Mm. Mm. You, go, you go, you see, what did I don't know be this? Look. No, I've never been a military man before, but I don't deal very close to soldiers, intelligence people. I know the way it works. So what is that they call arrowheads? It was in the papers today. Mm. What I'm saying is not see the DSS said that they have identified some arrowhead people. Mm. Mm. Because those who they perpetrate this violence, all these uh, cults, gang, then somebody go, they give the order. Then go don't then go don't identify all of them. Mm. Mm. So before you move, then no. Mm. So, and I tell people with all this talk, we say, it's a lose-lose situation. Make I explain on my back. Just give me two minutes. No problem, sir. It's a lose-lose. Okay, because of one candidate now, you go get injury. As they do talk, you go get injury. Mm. Eh? If candidates win, let's say that governorship, the, that candidate where they didn't guide you with, the day he become governor, you're not going to see him again. Mm. Oh, yeah. If he lost, he lost the election. He lose the election, he lost him. You know, you are the, the, the least, you exactly. can't find him. He just said, after I don't spend billions of naira, I can't lose the election. And I don't yeah. go go rest for Bahamas. Mm. Mm. So who go treat you? Mm. 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 If soldier hold you, this one's now, anybody where soldier hold for this one, then they say uh, they will take you to court. I hear you. Mm. Go, we are, I know be small picking. Mm. We have seen mm. what happened, God bless his soul, to the likes of buyers of that. When soldier Kola, when he come back, when he come back, he mere shadow of himself. Mm. So my advice to all you people, if you know say you know they vote, if you know get house, some of you they, go under that bridge, go put the uh, cat on where they sleep, recover yourself and sleep well well. Don't follow them, go to Kata election. Kola. Ah. And don't forget now, you know, say now police, you go, they still they drag road, they drag this mm. army with the other. They said they are ready to protect democracy at all costs. Very That's true. what the chief of defense staff said. Very true. That at all costs. When the trader tells you, I'm ready to defend something at all costs. They um, do everything. Look at the videos now. Ask yourself, for the videos, I see tank. Mm. Ah, I say, wait a minute, what's going mm. on? What it means, anybody who carries a weapon can fire it. If you don't know, know now. Look, you carry a weapon for defensive, yes, but you have the privilege and the order to use it if the need arises. Uncle Jerry, now, the thing that they show for our skills. You see, like these yes. are tanks. This now, one for broad if, 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 if they deploy these kind of tanks, what it just tells you is that if all of them go hide for inside the, the if go hide for inside the place, hmm. they can fire, they can, ah, let me quickly give an example without mentioning names. In the history of this country, there was a coup. 
the coup people ran into a public place. Hmm. They said when I go meet the chief of army staff at that time, say these people have run into the place, so they are civilians. He said, the chief of army, that's what we heard. He told them, fire and level the place. We'll fire take and care level. He told them not get time for nice things. Hmm. If look at you saw those tanks there. Mm -hmm. Is this enough for play? Hmm. Is this enough rifle then carry? So if you think that you can go and hide, uh, because you see, the level of arms where they Nigeria now is mind-boggling. Mm, that's true. Which also, which also now tells you that even civilian resistance in the election tomorrow it go high. Mm. If you go some areas. They say because we be area, but you go come out, go. Um, go they do this. You know the way to the other man carry. Yes. Uncle Jedi, we don't see the, the police and the army don't tell us, say, then they collaborate to see, say, nobody go come post and sign inside the guard of our democracy and everything go catch at where where. We also know, say, we get paramilitary them too, where we say they do their work. Mm. DSS, they say they do on top of the situation. NSCDC said they do their own. It get another group of people now where they say them to them, then they do something where they're very, very important because some people, they use money, they buy votes during election. The Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, them then they talk, say they don't deploy some of their personnel across the 36 states when they're inside Obodo, Nigeria. And say these people, where they carry go, then go stop vote buying. They say that they work in conjunction with all our security people to use ensure, say, people will not go keep money somewhere. Hoping, say, they go share this money to use it, collect votes. Say, it is no go work. But Uncle Jedi, some people don't come and come talk, say, not be the first time when EFCC, they talk this kind of thing. This. In fact, not be the first time when police, they talk, say, we will do, we will do. Say, we will do. Some people go still do badness. Whether in collabo with some bad eggs or they're not just there, there, as the thing take day. This one will consign vote buying, Uncle Jedi. You think, say, any difference go there for 2023? Especially now when people, they talk, say, Naira is cash. Some people say they don't get cash for hand. You know, say if some people come out with money and then feed do Kurukere Waka, it if it affects the way we say people go take votes. There's a warning from uh, INEC we talk, say, anybody where they involved in vote buying. Mm. Now, when they say anybody, you know, mean the politician will give you the money, mm. both the giver and the taker. Mm. So you, where they collect, you're also liable. And not to get confidence in EFCC saying that they monitor. Now, so they monitor primaries and not catch anybody. Mm. But money change hands, mm. including foreign currency. Mm. EFCC, they when person get bullion ban for, ban for house. They're not toxic. They even go knocking door once. Mm. So I not get, but this particular directive is coming from the presidency, mm. which mm. means, mm. which means that when you still they look EFCC here, say, hey, maybe you're not going to see you. The man standing next to you, know, you know, say, security people, mm. we know, non uniform people, you can't identify them. Amongst the people where they follow you do voters, amongst, some might even be the ones offering you money, see whether you go take them. So you better be careful. Mm. Not because of 1,000 naira, go, go enter trouble. Go there, cast your votes, do the needful. And, you know, it's not everything that is money. Very true. It's not everything that is money. Remember that they say that this time around, you must look at the, at the body language of Mr. President. And he's very, very determined. And all this comes under some kind of, sub, so, so, some kind of supervision of the, 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 the National uh, Security Advisor. Also comes. So he, he might not necessarily be using, they might juxtapose roles. Mm. Do you understand what I'm saying? Mm. Maybe not so that go catch some of the people who go the old money, but you need to be careful. Mm. The electoral law talks about the giver and the given. Mm. Meaning, if you know you have to reach that point, meaning the person will give you, and the person you, will, you will take. Will collect, mm. yeah. So not, be, not, because of, not because of voters, how much they go give yourself, you don't go think of your future for four years. Mm. Uncle Jedi, we could just give them this information because the EFC don't come out to talk, say they get one app. Then they call that app, Igu app. They say you feel download them for Google Play or Apple Store. Igu app. Say once you just see any Kurukere Waka, just send the information and leave it to them. They also talk, say, at official EFCC, on top of social media, you feel give them information. Or you go send them email at info at efcc.gov.ng. Uncle Jedi, Or better talk? still, sorry. Okay, no, no problem. No problem. Better sir. Still. No problem, sir. All of you clean your camera as well from a safe distance. When you see people, they do this thing. Mm. Make you record them. Mm. You can post it anonymously in the social media. 
we will be the ones to put pressure on the FCC. Say, say you say you they look for a person, mm. look this video. Mm. Mm. You know, no carry that camera, go photocopy your photo mm. because there doesn't no camera, uh, camera inside the place. But mm. let us all be active. Now, all of us, this thing concern. Very mm. true. Uncle Jerry, could also give them information say, we go day here yes. inside our studio mm. from tomorrow morning, go reach evening when the election will end. So that we will give you information as it takes concern the 2023 presidential and national assembly elections. If you want all the first hand information, just tune to Wazobia Max TV. We go follow now, wake up for morning, go reach evening. First hand information, now we go give you Then Uncle Jerry, maybe we can talk about the people when they inside this number of voters and why is it important to make the people then participate. Uh, according to the information where INEC give us, INEC been talk say of the total number of eligible voters, na 93.46 million. Even though they don't talk the number of people when get PVC, they call they talk about the distribution of these people. They say the highest na greatest bagba, greatest bobo. They say Nigerian students make up 26.8 percent, and their total number na 26.02 million. When I remember say for the introduction, we talk about the number of votes. When President Muhammad Buhari win for 2019, I say 15 million plus. I say Alaji Atiku Abubakar, 11 million plus that time. And the other presidential candidates no get up to 1 million plus. If you add 15 plus 11 plus, make we just talk, say 1 million, bear, bear. This one not reach 28 million. But Nigerian students for this election, now 26.02 million. And Uncle Jedi, you know, say, even you, when you be students for inside this country, you they talk about how you know, students and people will be say their passion for our country. It always they ginger them to do things. If they talk, say government they do anyhow, the students go enter street. If they talk, say something they happen, the students go enter street. But if I like say now, many of our students, I don't know. Person they struggle with GS course. If they struggle with hundred level. If they do this, if they do that. If I like say Nigeria not even really did their body again. Uncle Jerry, I want you to speak to Nigerian students. But before you speak to them, more go this break, come back. When we go this break, come back. Uncle Jerry, you'll get the opportunity to speak to them. Students, oh, farmers. Farmers, plenty for this country. Oh. We will give you now the number. Farmers, there are plenty. Oh. And you don't say farmers. A lot of things affect them with insecurity. Because now land, now that they cultivate. If they don't go their land, now problem. How they go take votes? When we come back, we'll continue the discussion. Based on accident, special. They have planted the government some people down here. They will seal up their ear. Once they seal up their ear, they will go back to sleep. Then I will talk about that. They have planted the government some people down here. They will seal up their ear. Once they seal up their ear, they will go back to sleep. Yes, and welcome back to the program, Sir Man, as the hot, and of course, um, the Friday special with um, Uncle JD and my brother, Ezuku Chukudi, also still there here. And I'm looking at, oh, so far, we don't search now, we don't tell them different things. We will carry come give now. We tell them about um, INEC, we don't release that the number of people where they're eligible to vote. They're going by waiting, PVC, we don't collect. And they talk now, it's 7 million. 209,000 and them seven, um, you know, uh, and seven, um, you know, PVCs, nine people don't collect. I also tell them about the militaries and them in conjunction with the police. We talk, say, look, oh, this election, then our democracy, they want to protect, uh, say, make any Nigerian, we talk, say, in stubborn, or we talk, say, you know, chop point for your house, or you know, talk, say, you know, they suck in mama breast well, uh, say, make you no know, just come try anything here. See, by the time you can't try anything, anything we see, make you take. So far, these are the two stories we will not search, and I will still be on top. I will still get other stories to also search on. So, looking at um, the next one, I uh, heard. If we ask Uncle Jedi one question before we go to that break. The question Uncle will Jedi. consign uh, Nigerian students. Nigerian students, Uncle Jedi. Then I then call get this back back. Then I then back back, boo boo. You know, sometimes to take students, to differentiate them out of the rest. Mm. Um, Sometimes, let us just talk to young people. Mm. 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 Because whether you are a student or not, mm. uh, um, uh, if you are a young person, because when you say student, what about those where they work? Mm. Those who are young. And make it no be like, say, we give students priority. Because this matter where they ground, it pass greatest by greatest bobo. It concern everybody. Mm. It's very simple. I've said it today a thousand times, and I will repeat it again. 
The future of this country is in your hands. This election calls for either an endorsement of, of as we may be, mm. either for us to say to the world and say to ourselves, we want to continue like this. We're happy as we day, yeah, you no, know, not this point, as we day, uh, hungry, all kinds of things not go well, we're happy. Or that we want a change. It's a matter of choice. Mm. And it is numbers. Now, you go, there is no other determinant about the way a country should go but numbers. i give you an example. The UK one time then do, um, what is it with this moratorium? No, referendum. Referendum about Brexit. Yes. It was the wrong thing to do, but that's what the majority wanted, wanted because they took an emotional decision. The prime minister, in his wisdom at that time, he just leave government, say, I'm not the follower, I do this. Mm. They come out, they go. And they are now stuck with it. Mm. And they are now suffering by it. But nobody cannot talk. That is what the majority wanted. So I want to call on young people, especially, we, we don't hold though. If I die for this studio as I talk now, my children must kill cow. Mm. Mm. If they get money, then go call Sonny. If they not call Sonny, then go look for. Wasi. No, my children are not there for that Wasi. Maybe they will call Femi Kuti or mm. Whiskey. Or Made. Uh, they feel called Whiskey, Bonner Boy. You know, I see now. You know I, 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 I believe and I taught my children to, to even in, in listening and appreciating music, mm. it must have a message. Mm. It's, life is not about entertainment. Mm. You know, when I was growing up, in between, in between all the entertainment where we do, as you see me, so I know they go to disco when I'm young. Na fella place I they go. I they listen to fella. I they listen to Okoso. Only Okoso. I they go lectures. In between, as I they do that one, I be rare. Mm. So no be say I be care. No. <laughs> but we had the purpose, and that is what is holding us in good stead. Mm. The way I look, many people wonder. I'm not a rich man, but I've grown up to become a very contented person with the little that I have, mm. which is the message that young people should also imbibe. Mm. And we learn this and so nobody wants. So back to what I'm saying, sir, before I completely derail. Young people, I beg you now, go out there and vote. Be orderly. Don't let them, because of your disorderliness, say they won't cancel one vote. Mm. You know? Go out there and play your part. I say with the bold test, during the Muditala Mohammed coup, before the coup was quelled, we were already on the streets. Mm. I was in the University of Benin. Go out, came Amudu, we retired from NAVDAC. I saw him the other day, Indian Labour Party is still on. All of us, the day when, when Ghani comes, we follow him, go court, go. We, we had the sense of purpose. But unfortunately now, majority have a sense of entitlement. You have a sense of entitlement, you don't want to contribute. Mm. That cannot be. At all. Uncle Jedi, as you don't talk to Nigerian students, will be 26 points, zero. Not Nigerian students. So I spoke Nigeria, to young, young people. people. Young people. Uh, but uh, given and the way we let it. Let us go, go. Mm. Does not stop with students. Okay. It exactly. goes with every young Everybody. Person, yes. Back, back, go, go. Make everybody dig back, back, go, go, they go. But Uncle Jedi, we'll see they look the numbers. Uh, make I just give these three categories. They say farmers, they make up 15.8%. Those ones, they be 14.74 million. Housewives, housewives, those ones be 13.9%. They be 13 million of those where they registered. They go to say business class. Those ones are 12.45 million, making 13.3%. Uncle Jody, the reason why I emphasize on these three categories now say, people, they look people when be business class people. Mm. And then they look, say, business class people, them, then they see themselves as different people or special people for inside of Bodo Nigeria. And many of them, they know they agree participate for this election matter. Some of them on election day, they go just on generator, day for house, they drink tea, they watch international news. They say, I cannot go out. Politics is a dirty game. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to be a part of it. And then they talk say many of these people directly, the things when government, they do, they impact their lives. 
Uncle Jenny, you think, say, those will be business class people. When some people, they look there and say, maybe middle class. This one, get moto, if they live for flat, if they travel abroad sometimes. You think, say, this election, then go really shake body where we Two things. One, the figures where you, where you read out now, mm. it shows that the people have the power. Mm. 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 And the, the, the people will cause all the Wahala way did this our country today. Majority of them are in the elites. Mm. And then be the top politicians. Mm. Then go then go then, 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 then go dabaru your mind. Mm. Go they take money, they, they, they draw you small, small. Okay. Small, small. Till your head goes scatter. See that man, I'm not gonna mention his name. <laughs> this is a joke. <laughs> See, this is, but you know, it's an example of, of what happens. So we have the numbers. Mm. Don't let them lead you on. Mm. Don't believe politicians are the sweet mouth people. When the time comes, now then go they enjoy those elites where you just say they drink tea, they drink a tea for house. Mm. They don't take money by their own election. Mm. They don't go buy t-shirts for with you, uh, mm. with you go with the t-shirt. Now them supply the money with them take buy guns and everything. Kay. And you know say. The format of the elites don't they change? Mm -hmm. A lot of the elite, I'm sorry to say, in our country, live on government. Mm -hmm. Name it, live on government. People who don't run from ordinary people, don't run, enter elites. They still live, live on government. Mm -hmm. When you look at the ones where they run, they say that they run this, you know, or that, you know. Everybody lives on government. Now them be contractor. Now them be this. Now them picking go day work mm -hmm. for on guard level. Mm -hmm. You don't see big man picking will be driver before. It's not possible. So, from the figures that you have, if you, the people at that level where you talk, mm. if they have a sense of purpose, come together and do not allow these people to divide them. Mm. Because they do all kinds of things. They go take money, they bury you here. They go take religion, they bury you here. They go take ethnic they bury you here. Mm. But when you, when you see them, look at the social media. Oh, my mother from, a, my friend from another mother, my brother from another mother. Mm. One wear Babariga, the other one carry, uh, we are a Betiaja. My sister from another mother, but they go to Dabaru, you for mm. under. Mm. Mm. Look mm. at a gathering of elites. Look at a gathering of elites. They know they ever quarrel with They know they ever quarrel. Mm. When they want to start the ceremony, let a pastor give us the pastor go, go do everything. Let the uh, uh, they are like the they are not go settle, everything go day quiet. Their children, but they will marry their children. They try to marry their children, but they go come to bury you from for back. Thank you. It's, it's up to you. Mm. Very true. People, mm. we have been, somebody like me, we've been in this quest for a better Nigeria for a long time. Mm. This is the climax. Mm. If we fail this time around, some of us go retire. Mm. Mm, mm. It means that it is a, it is a basket case. Mm. Because I don't know what else you want God to do for you. God has opened your eyes to see these things. Mm. This mm. is not the time to be praying. How you going to pray the close eye when big meat day or day in oh. front of you? Oh. Ah, this is not the time. This is not the time to be praying. This is the time for all of you to get up. They sure. dangerous. So you they pray. They close eyes. Big me there front of you. Are you in the Are you the chop with Unkubi? Unkubi there here. And Unkubi there there. Yeah. <laughs> now dangerous, you know. <laughs> Uncle Jerry talking about people when they dangerous. Unkubi, my brother Simon Epa. Uh -huh. So this one, um, of course, that uh, the Finland authorities, uh, talk, uh, according to the report, who guys, they say they want they arrest them Simon Epa, and this Simon Epa. And uh, now Finnish, uh, that is a um, um, citizen, now Finland indeed. And looking at them um, from the footage, now the young, now the young man with that, uh, this one we say, the kind of um, violence where they incite for Southeast, where they instruct to make everybody sit at home, where they affect the economic uh, you know, value for that place, every Monday, everybody is there for that, they don't go, go work. And also some other killings, where they attributed to all these kind of actions, where they call. And um, of course, I caught, they call also talk, say, a few hours later, then release them. So that release and few, few hours later. He is a Finnish um, citizen. But in the instruct things where they happen for here, you understand? We don't cause a lot of death for, for, for Southeast. Looking at this particular action we um, Finnish um, take, and looking at the present reality, until say, even right now, for the Southeast people, they fear, say, they no go feel come out, come vote. Until say, they don't order them to make them sit at home. What will be your own take on this? I look the man now. 
Say as a body cool. It's fresh. Fresh. It's fresh. Of Finland, you know. Fresh. Of Finland. Citizen, you know. They don't chop sausage, they don't chop everything. Look at mine be that. It's left to our people, you know, uh, because as they arrest them now, they don't release them. Uh. Ask yourself why. We are living in a very, very competitive world. Hmm. We need to understand that. In this world that we are evening, there is no friend, no foe, but interest. Hmm. A developed Africa is a challenge to Europe. So in this area of development, your competitor cannot be your friend. Hmm. You understand? I mean, I know they're excited, say they arrest them, they arrest them, sharp, sharp, they release them. If he was a threat to their own government, would they release him immediately? Mm. You need to smell the coffee. You need to smell the coffee. And the message is to our people back home. See him. You were there back home. They say you should sit at home on Monday. You cannot go to market. You cannot do anything. You, you, you're supposed to ask yourself, ah, wait a minute. I don't rest on Sunday. I don't rest on Sunday. Which one be this Monday again? Because somebody for Finland, Uber, maybe Uber, cities, you know, Siam. for that side. Siam. Mm. You know, we need, we need to, this is another topic we're going to bring entirely. I am not saying that there is, there is every reason for people to be say, to the talk, even say, Ag this, this, say yes, like this is yes. the way we get, we won't come out, if, as long as you follow. Yes, the yeah. people, but you cannot follow something and be wounding yourself. Mm -hmm. This is an opportunity. This election where they say make you no do is an opportunity. You can put people who have these principles that you are fighting for, and they will not go to the center to go and fight. Very true. But now now go, go vote for a person who given her money. When it is there, he go to go buy this vote of seven hundred and thirty thousand dollars. Maybe we see one of the governors where we are at. You don't see one of the governors will get white Rolls Royce. Mm. You don't know how much they deserve Rolls Royce. Mm. You know how much they deserve Rolls Royce. You don't buy one. I don't say they expensive. They did for like two hundred. You know they. You know they. You know they. You know they expensive. Mm. It is astronomical. Mm. Mm. Uncle it is uh, what do you call them? Astronomical. Astronomical. Uncle Jedi, I believe say with all this talk where you don't talk, many Nigerians them, their mind go down. A lot of people mind don't they made up already. Because if we check the number of people where we say PVC is there in their hand, and the way when we say people they put body for this election, you go see say plenty of people they interested to participate. Uh, but make we just share quick information when we go help you. I beg, like Uncle Jedi don't talk. This election, not the election where you go wake up to say, ah. It be like say I go go in Kubi the area I go vote. I will go to Kubi the area I go vote. Now the place where you register, the closest polling unit to you. Now there you go fee vote. Mm. I next already tell us say 8:30 a.m. tomorrow. Now then go start and it go begin first with accreditation. They will collect your uh, PVC. They go do use them with the beavers. Once he confirm say ah, this person now here, your name there here, you go wait. When you reach to vote, you go start to vote. But how you go take note your polling unit? Two simple steps. Step one, you go text your, the state where you for register. The state where you for register. Your last name, that is your surname. And then the last six digits of your voter identification number. You go text them to this number where we say we don't share. Me and my brother since last week. 90 6283 0860. Make I take that number again. 090-6283-0860. Or you feel still send this same message of the state where you register your surname and the last six digits of your voter identification number to 090-6283-0861. That one now one step. The second step now to go on top of where I neck website. And the website now www that's three w www.voters.inecnigeria.org www.voters.inecnigeria.org or www.cvr.inecnigeria.org forward slash VVS. Now, waiting there the screen like this. Now, if you use your phone, snap them now. Make you check. I beg. We take your beg una. If you go your polling unit tomorrow, behave in a responsible manner. No go wear the cloth of any political party. Oh. Mm. No wear cloth of any political party. No follow anybody argue. Now, like on Kujedi, don't talk. Now, very close to your area, you feel Waka go there. And I believe, say, unless you be a bad person, 
But you go people for your area go know you. Now go they greet each other. And so if you not live for the same area, you not go one break each other head. Make everybody just maintain calm. Vote. Wait if you want wait. I need talk say 300 meters away from the place where we say the ballot box day. And now three ballot papers they go give you tomorrow. Presidential, Senate, and House of Representatives. If you want vote, use your index finger. This one. Use them. Make sure say the thing not pass the column, the box where we say the logo of the party where you won't vote for day. Because if you do have the thing pass, you don't waste time with that. Oh, we take God beg everybody. May God keep all of us alive. Now Nigeria, we talk say be our country, mm -hmm. and we must contribute to make our country great. Uncle Jerry, thank you very much for the words of wisdom when we say you don't share, and for the reassurance when we say you don't give us today. We appreciate your presence. Thank, thank you. you. Thank, thank you. you very much, Uncle Jerry. Mm -hmm. So we'll come back once again next week Monday with another beautiful edition from our humble self. And um, of course, wishing every Nigerian um, um, a successful and um, general election when they come up tomorrow. See so, Monday, we'll go soon again. Now, bye bye.